membership into the prestigious Abeokuta Club, established in 1972, is an exclusive preserve of sons of Egba extraction who have distinguished themselves in various spheres of life, though there is a proviso of honorary membership to non-indigenous. None was found worthy since inception. Sir Kesintin Adebukola Adebutu, however, broke the jinx and emerged the first non egba indigen conferred with the honorary membership of the club in recognition of his contributions to socio-economic development of not just Egba land, but Ogun State and indeed other parts of the country and beyond. <laughs> The occasion of the 45th president party of the club was a roll call of Egba's sons, royal fathers, and eminent Nigerians who came to honor Sir Kesintin Adebutu. He has not only contributed to the economic development of Egba land, he has tremendously contributed to the development of Oku State, to the development of Nigeria, and to the commercial life of the whole country, Nigeria. The magnificent quality of Sadi Butu speaks volume of his person. And this is known across Nigeria, even internationally. For those that are favored by God, should spread the word. That's the only way to elevate poverty. But he can be honored at all. Must have made some contributions that attracted that honor. If you're talking about Sadi Kesinti and Debutu, made some contributions before you are honored at all. And of course, we expect to continue to further those contributions you made before you are considered for that honor in the first instance. He comes for Remo. He's been honored in Egba land because of his contribution to education, health, industry, and uh, tourism. The man of the moment expressed delight and promised to contribute his quota to the development of the club and Egba land. Very, very glad. And I thank God. I thank the Egba people for this great honor done to me. And God willing, they will not regret it. And they can borrow it from us, and that's why we came as a matter of uh, solidarity. Um, he's a good man, and we just hope that he will continue to do what he's been doing best. Juju Maestro and eminent Egba son, Chief Ebenezer Obe, was on the bandstand. <laughs>